Hey YouTube, Jim here. Welcome to Top 10 Archive. You think you've seen it all when it comes to the animal kingdom, right? Three-legged dogs, two-headed snakes, Bigfoot. Wait, I'm not the only one, am I? Oh, well, anyway, these things are normal compared to what we have in store for you in this video. Get ready to experience the wacky, the weird, and the totally strange with these top 10 animals you won't believe exist. Before we blow you away, be sure to subscribe and click the bell for more from the Top 10 team. Like what you watched? Be sure to hit the like button. And while you're down there, leave a comment so we can have a little chat. Number 10. Striated Frogfish This ugly little morsel can be found all over, from the western Atlantic Ocean to the Indo-Pacific, hiding within the rocky and sandy habitats of the deep blue. Commonly found at depths of 130 feet, the spiny-looking frogfish camouflages itself to blend into its surroundings, which is good because it's pretty hideous to look at. The worm-like appendages are used to lure fish in as it sits on the ocean floor, shaking its adornments as a means of attracting a feast. Number 9. Okapi Half giraffe, half zebra, half horse. Wait, that's too many halves. Oh, well, that's not important. What is important is how utterly strange this relative of the giraffe looks. That's right, this mammal here is not zebra brethren, but rather within the giraffidae family. Okapis are found mostly in the Aturi forest of Central Africa, but you're more likely to see one at the San Diego Zoo. Okapi appreciate their solitude, which is why it wasn't until 1900 that scientists even knew they existed. Number 8. Stoat why can't you believe this tiny mammal exists? Because look at that face. I mean, look how cute it is. Just to look. Anyway, this relative of weasels, ferret, otter, badger, and wolverines skitters around the mountainous woodland and coastal regions within the Northern Hemisphere. They've been spotted in Europe, Asia, and North America with scarce sightings at the Arctic Circle. At an average of just over a foot long, the stoat is a quirky creature that appreciates being left alone and won't fight for its territory. Oh, and did we mention just how gosh darn cute they are too? <laughs> Number seven, one ton pigs. Now that is a fat pig. And with a fat pig like that, oh boy, there's a ton of bacon right there in front of our eyes. But no, that's not what this award-winning porker is for. In fact, this delicious specimen is part of a Taiwanese ritual performed at the Sansia Sushi Temple in Yinko. To get the pig this large, locals force-feed them to a weight of just under one ton. The winning pig, or the largest, earns its farmer a gold prize while the swine is taken to the temple and, well, murdered. Moral of the story? Be wary of people that offer you an endless supply of food. Just a second, my, my wife just finished cooking dinner. Oh, wait a minute. Number six, Zeus, the Great Dane. If ever there was a Dane that was great, it was Zeus, the great, great Dane that was larger than life. At more than three feet tall on all fours, Zeus could stand on his hind legs and tower over the average person at seven feet, four inches. At five years old, Zeus passed away in September of 2014, but his big and bold personality was immortalized in the Guinness World Records when he was pegged as the world's tallest dog. Number five, Angora rabbit. A type of domesticated rabbit, the Angora is beautiful, soft, and prime for snuggling. Known for being one of the oldest domesticated rabbits and hailing from the former Angora region of what is now present-day Turkey, this cuddly bunny is often raised for its wool, which is why you'll happen across Angoras that look like <clears throat> this. Admittedly, it's a lot less cute when in its final form, but there's still no denying that this Leporidae is the fluffiest little nugget out there and a strange addition to those typical hopping delights we see day in and day out. Number four, Cheranook. Looking more like a Tim Burton creation than an actual animal, the Cheranook is most commonly found in East Africa, just east of Ethiopia in the Somalia region. Cheranooks thrive in wooded vegetation, preferring to avoid open habitats as its long neck allows it to grab food off of shorter trees and other foliage. For taller trees, the Cheranook stands on its hind legs. 
though its curiously long and scrawny legs make it look like a relative of the giraffe, the Chirinook fits in with the gazelle tribe. Number 3. Chinese Water Deer What the is this? This is photoshopped, right guys? Oh look, it's real! Ah, and it's harmless. Though it may sport the nickname of Vampire Deer, Chinese Water Deer won't go from house to house seeking an invitation just to score a late night snack. In fact, those teeth aren't even used to eat. In territorial fights, the elongated tusks, which can grow up to 3.2 inches, are used to inflict wounds when things get physical. Number 2. Wolf Fish Wolf Spider, Wolf Man, Wolf Cop As if there weren't enough wolves out in the world, the Atlantic Wolf Fish aims to add one more to the mix. As you can see, it looks nothing like a fish, but they do have some things in common their ferocious teeth, and their predatory instincts. The wolffish are able-bodied hunters of the deep blue that chow down on spiny invertebrates, sea urchins, crabs, and marine snails thanks to their sharp canines. The wolffish can grow up to five feet long, so it's no small critter lurking at the ocean's depths. Number 1. Genetically Engineered Dogs Afraid of dogs? No. Well, you will be. At least if you ever run into any of these genetically engineered dogs, which come straight out of Ang Lee's Hulk. Or China. I guess it's probably China. <laughs> to create buff pups like Wendy the Whippet here, in whom the process comes naturally, Chinese scientists do a little playing god and alter their genetic code. For instance, their lab-created beagles have the myostatin gene removed, which, when in place, regulates the canine's muscle mass. So, now that we know that we can create muscular dogs through genetic alterations, is now the point where we stop and ask if we should. Thanks for watching. What other strange and or delightful creatures like these do you know about that we missed in this archive? Tell us about them in the comments. We'd love it if you'd subscribe, click the bell, then enjoy more Top 10 Archive videos like these two.